A 76-year-old man serving life in prison for the 1957 murder of a little girl has always maintained his innocence. Now the state's attorney in DeKalb County says he believes Jack McCullough. And that prosecutor says the murder conviction should be overturned. As CBS 2's Brad Edwards reports, it's a decision that's not sitting well with the brother of Maria Rodolph, the seven-year-old girl who was kidnapped and killed. In a place with 17,600 people, it's the one not counted they talk about most. Nearly 60 years ago, seven-year-old Maria Ridoff vanished. I'm embarrassed to say that, but it was anger, and I am angry. Her brother, then 11, is now 70. It was a crime against this community, and I've lived in this community. He still lives just blocks from the haunted intersection. Jack McCullough. I did not kidnap that little girl. Despite denials, was convicted of killing Maria in 2012. Now, the new state's attorney, Richard Schmack. I think he's not guilty of what he's been convicted of. Saying new evidence, including a collect call, puts McCullough in Rockford at the time of the disappearance. With these records, it shows that he couldn't have been two places at once, which is what the FBI found in 1957, and which is why they cleared him in 1957. Next week, McCullough, a man who's thought to have sexually abused his own sister, will likely go free, he told 48 Hours. I may have been a sinner, but I'm not a murderer. I didn't get the notice of this until this morning via email. On his way to Good Friday service, he still has this picture that laid on his sister's baby casket some 59 years ago on Good Friday. I prayed for forgiveness because of my anger, and I prayed for the Lord to enable me to rejoice, to rejoice that Maria is above this. Brad Edwards, CBS 2 News. Thank you, Brad. Late today, the Illinois State Police released a statement saying the ISP conducted a thorough investigation and McCullough's murder conviction was upheld by the second appellate court.